An essential skill that increases the efficiency of an engine company is being able to operate an inch and three quarter hand line by yourself. When the nozzle man is able to operate and maneuver the nozzle on his own, it allows the hydrant man to shift from a backup position into the control position. This allows the line to move faster to the seat of the fire. This technique is called the lock off. Brian Brush has been teaching it in his Exponential Engine Company class because it is an easy way to operate a hand line. Start off by tucking the line high under your armpit and adjust the hose so that your opposite hand just reaches the end of the nozzle. Kneel down on your left knee, place your right leg perpendicular to your body. Lower your upper body and brace your right arm against your right thigh. Next, keep your right leg high and angled forward with your body low and the hose as close to your midline as possible. As you are opening the nozzle, lean forward. By doing this, you are basically turning your body into a hose clamp. Your right thigh inside will absorb most of the nozzle reaction. When moving in the lock off, keep the hose pinned to your right side and place your left arm on the ground. Your left arm and right leg move forward together. Then bring your left leg forward. Move about five feet at a time, work the nozzle, and then repeat. The lock-off technique is also an excellent way to back up a firefighter. Get into the lock off just like you would if you had the nozzle, making sure you are as close to the nozzle man as possible. Place your left arm on the ground to allow yourself to get low. Give a slight lean and push forward in anticipation of the nozzle reaction. Now to demonstrate the lock off using a hit and move technique. 